Uh, Janelle Fort looked up from the rooftop of the Perot Museum in downtown Dallas. Had an incredible view uh, today. Janelle, tell us what uh, tell us what your day was like. Well, hey, Matt, it was a bit of a contrast to what you had in rural Ennis. Of course, the Perot Museum in the heart of downtown Dallas. Thousands of people flocked here to take in the experience. Uh, there was food trucks. There was live entertainment. There were scientists here to put things into context. When the doors first opened around 10 o'clock this morning, uh, there was a bit of fear that the clouds weren't going to move out of the way. But by 140, when totality hit, they did. And we were able to take in a truly remarkable experience. With me. People from near and far filled the Perot Museum Monday, ready to take in the celestial spectacle of the total solar eclipse. It's once in a lifetime for a lot of people. Families like the Copes, dad, son, and grandma, who came in from Denver. My mom came up with the idea that we should come down here, and uh, we were looking at different places. We settled on Dallas. Most at the museum understood the basics of what was about to happen, and were ready as the sky progressively got darker and the temperature dropped. But even with the anticipation, the actual moment the moon and sun aligned still caught us all by surprise. <laughs> That's unreal. We heard cheers, then an eerie quietness. Everyone's eyes to the dark skies. It feels like night. For roughly four minutes, we took it all in. When you look up, pardon? Wow. What is happening? The rare sight was last seen in Dallas in 1878 and it won't occur again for some 300 years. It didn't feel like night, it didn't feel like day, it felt like something else entirely, and it was really stunning. Then just as it started, the total solar eclipse ended. Lightness progressively creeped back in, birds once again started chirping, nature falling back in line. I'm really happy we got to see it here. I'm really happy the clouds played ball, because, oh man, <laughs> that was awesome same sentiment across the Perot as everyone thanked Mother Nature for giving us a break and opening the skies. In Dallas, I'm Janelle Ford. And